Now let's look at some clips about you developing your game. You appear, as you mentioned, more composed than you were before, willing to wait for the ball before sort of timing your tackle. As a young player, what would you give advice in those situations as we mentioned before? We're going we're gonna to roll through a number of clips. This one first, sort of a 2v1 situation, Harry. What would you say to a young player? I think you've got to keep dropping, keep dropping until the right moment. And I think you see it's a, it's a great moment where Tom goes towards the ball. Um, and I managed to drop off state. I could easily, probably earlier on in my career, I probably just jump out at it. Yeah. And they just slide the ball through. And but you need to wait for the right moment, wait for the right timing. And I think um, so having your body body position in the right way as well, yeah, sort think, of orientated to the ball. Yeah, I think your body position as a centre half, you've always got to be side on. Never get square with the ball. Um, if you get square with the ball, I think the the ball can even go either side of you too easy. So side on, preparing to run back to your own goal, um, and just delay things really. So this is another situation, this time it's actually Marcus running at you? Yeah, I can see there that the, he's running at uh, Tom and we know that Marcus is a big threat that, get, yeah. that game. So, And again, yeah, as soon as, situation in as, the box. As soon as Marcus gets around the ball, we knew that we had to be tight to him, yeah. um, allow no shots. Now it's up against Latam. Again, for Manchester United, it was absolutely fantastic in the Premier League. So for a young player as well, you're assessing Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Could go left side, could go right side. How do you prepare for that? I think you've got to, when you get in this situation here, um, keep him out of the keep him out of the box as long as you can. So when the when the pass goes, maybe can can I get a little bit tight? I probably would do now. I'll probably go tight as I can there now. Um, I'll let him turn a little bit, but you just got to be able to be keep your distance and then prepare to to slide and block when you think the the timing's right. Got another player up against now, Tammy Abraham. Similar question. So, Tammy, you've got to be maybe a little bit touch tight to him. So, as a young player, a young footballer coming up, you've got to really assess your opponent and then think, do I need to be tight? Do I need to drop off a little bit? Yeah, I think you've got to play to your own strengths as well. One of my big strengths is, is actually my strength. Um, so, I've got to, I like to make contact with the striker. I like to feel the, con uh, the striker and, and use, my, use my strength and my weight to, to, to make it an advantage for myself. But now I know Tammy and he likes to roll defenders and... Um, He's good with the ball to his feet, so I think getting tight as you can to him, uh, make it hard for him, I think you can see here. Another situation. He's good the in these situations. Um, but I'm so tight to him, he can't really move away from me. And um, no, it was, a, it, was a, it was a great moment for myself and obviously a great debut for myself. And um, it's Fantastic a, counter attack, but you know, arguably you win the tackle that leads to such a good attacking bit of play. As a defender, do you feel that sort of like you're scoring a goal in that situation? Yeah, definitely, especially this was such an important goal at the time. Um, and it was a big game for myself, my debut, obviously. So no, I really, I really felt a good buzz after that, having known that I've, I've broke up the, the attack, and um, that's what I'm there to do. That's, that's what us defenders do, and it's, it's as good as a goal when we, when we see something like that.